Hey guys, Hi. welcome to Comment Commentary. Uh, we go through your comments all mm -hmm. throughout the week and we comment on them. That's kind of an overstatement. Yeah. We choose like three per, yeah. for a few videos. Well, we don't need uh, to tell them that. Yeah, we, well, now you know. We're tearing back the curtain. And before we do that, however, we have a brand spanking new Facebook banner yes, photo from Claire Elise Young. Claire Elise Young, I'm assuming, is the person who took the photo, but these are a couple of wonderful EMT gentlemen yeah. that are saving people's lives. Looks like they have a printout of SourceFed. So uh, thank you for watching, guys. And if you are not the cover photo, you might be uh, just a regular Facebook photo. And here's a bunch of those. <laughs> releases some Mercury photos. What? The first what? ever photos of uh, Mercury's surface, which we thought was kind of exciting because we're I just to be know that when it's in retrograde, I am screwed. I know, <laughs> right? <laughs> it's like, give me my life back. Uh, you know? I know. It's like, oh, Mercury in retrograde? Science, give like, me you know, my uh, life back. I was almost shot images. point blank with no. a gun. Together. And I was like, no. what is Mercury in retrograde? Oh, Mercury. Oh, Mercury. Exhausted. Oh, and here it seems to oh. I miss Joe. In case you are wondering, by the way, why Joe isn't here, Joe's on uh, in Alaska. <laughs> so yeah, like that's all the explanation you're gonna get. Lost Angelino said, "Grace is so funny and random. I love it." Well, that's a good comment. Grace wasn't in that video, <laughs> but uh, <laughs> she, she was really fantastic. Funny, if you uh, didn't miss some of the videos, you can go back and check it out. We have a behind the scenes. We have some. Uh, she's gonna be in some of the bloopers. That's a lot of fun. But she was a delight. I was very sad that I wasn't there that day. I missed the Grace fun. Yeah. yeah, they might not get along. I don't think they would. You really be honest. think so? Yeah. No. no when she came in, she was like, "Steve's Steve's not here," and we were like, "Yeah, no." And there was kind of like this moment of her just being like. Oh. Then she like could be herself. Okay. Yeah. Does that make you feel weird? Not at all. Yeah. Uh. All right. Okay. Anyway, do we have an out here yet? <laughs> Fucking Frunk was Joe's uh, segment where he talked about bear fights and 15 story falls. Mm -hmm. And the question uh, he asked you was, wow us with your drunken story. Wow us! Angel Solikov said, there was this one time I was so drunk I couldn't remember what happened the next day. So I woke up and saw I had a message. Turns out I had a girlfriend and she was hot. And apparently when I'm drunk, I'm irresistible. So you know, thank you, alcohol. You move super fast. Like you apparently met this girl, established yeah. a relationship, had and a then girlfriend, sealed the deal in hey, terms boyfriend. of elastic. Like like you're going steady. Maybe just drunk just makes her make really bad decisions. The other thing is, is like yeah. he says he's hey, he had a message and he said she was hot. So how do you know she's hot from a message? Like did she say she's hot? What mm. if it was like one of those one eight hundred hotline numbers yeah. where you just we're finding they sound holes hot. in your story. Yeah. yeah. Drew B vlog said me and three friends were on a holiday. Holiday. We all got so drunk the next day we awoke to our hotel room trashed. Oh. oh no, we thought it was pretty funny at the time until we noticed that one of us was missing. <laughs> Our friend Doug, so he took clues from the things we had on us and tried to trace back where we remember seeing Doug last. Maybe we come across, turns out he was on a roof whole time. Crazy, crazy night. This is the last time <laughs> I read one of these comments and believe it, it's actually a plot. This is the movie The Hangover. I gotta just, start wait, picking up on these way faster and I don't. It's always like halfway through. I'm like, this ain't real. You just got drewed. I just got drewed. <laughs> Armando Rubio says, I was drinking my pants and we had a quinceanera once and after about a 24 pack and seven solo cups full of tequila and ice, I succeeded in getting up from the chair I was sitting on, only to plummet forward onto another chair. I felt nothing. However, my brother tells me that my head landed on that chair, breaking it. From the moment I stood up <laughs> till the time I woke up the next morning, I remember nothing. Shots were fired that night. Okay, you know what? This is a perfect opportunity uh, <laughs> to put a little disclaimer in here. Uh, alcohol is dangerous. Be responsible. Don't drink and drive and try not to slam your face into chairs. That poor quinceanera yeah. girl. Well, like that girl is like, just like, I'm a woman. <laughs> No, yeah. she's having the time of her life. She probably didn't even notice what was happening. Steve has no drunk stories. No, I have no, zero don't. drunk stories. Have I don't drink. Stories. Never been drunk in my life. I don't need to, I don't think. I think I'm fine without it. He loves Pepsi so much. Oh, Pepsi! Oh, with that sugar rush in my body! Yeah. We're gonna spike his Pepsi one day. Just yeah. No, you happens. can't do no, that. No, I wouldn't do that to you, buddy. That's why I have this cool little iPhone device that you can just drop into water. It's like a little thing, and your iPhone tells you if there's alcohol in it. <laughs> also detects roofies and spiders. Because you do not want to drink a spider. Do you believe in love after love? Like a reason thin inside of sand. I really don't think you're strong enough, no. Where's our album? Are we working on an album? I don't think we should. I mean, we just got it. I can Elliot Solo. Do you believe in love after 
what is it? Life, life after, after love. love. Do you believe on, in life after love? Do you believe in life after love? We can auto tune. Do you do? Do you believe in my life? Do you believe in love after love? How could you be so heartless? <laughs> It just sounds like an old lady singing in tune. I'm on a boat, yeah. I'm on a home for, I'm in a, I'm in a Burger King. I'd like a Whopper. I think that's like, I think it should be used more sparingly. Can I have a taco? Oh, you're right, like on the syllables. Yeah. Can I get a thing of cinnamon twist? A large Baja Blast, please. Can you add the chalupa sauce or the chipotle sauce is what I meant. Doritos, locos, tacos, and <laughs> Yours actually sounds kind of real. I'm working on it. Norm taught me that. It's really good. All right guys, so Alzheimer's was reversed by blocking a receptor in mice. And so we asked you guys, what would you cure if you had the option? Joseph Craven said, I would cure dyslexia. Dyslexia, 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 do you see what I mean? Why do they give you such a hard word to spell? <laughs> to a learning disability which impedes spelling and reading and writing. That is pretty funny. Very fun. good observation. Mm -hmm. Balthazar CH said anything, I go with stupidity, the rest will fix itself. Oh. oh. Boom, laying down truth. Wow. Yeah. You're holding that mirror up to society, brah. Dude, and society's gonna look into it and be like, yo, we're dumb. Yeah. We gotta fix ourselves. Also, I've got a yeah. blackhead I should probably get rid of. Black Eyes 7317 said, I would cure meat to last the long winter, because I am a man. That's what a man would do. That's beautiful. If you had the option to <laughs> cure <laughs> anything. Hold on, wait, he is would this go really Nord? <laughs> that's really good. Nord. Nord, did you Nord, did you that's you. Yeah, meat. was that you, Nord? I would you? cure meat, because I'm a man. Uh, you know what I'd cure? Probably like bacon. What do you cure when you do cure meat? Vegetarianism. That's not very nice. It's Holding the mirror up to society. I was eating, I was Specifically like, the vegetarians. I would like y'all to know that I was eating a salad the other day and Norg looked at me and said, why are you eating the food my foodie? <laughs> so gruff. Hey, why are you eating the food so my foodies? So adorable. <laughs> I'm working on my Precious. impression of you, it's, I'm nailing it. Runaway Express said allergies, then I'll be able to run through a field of lilies and Aww. eat peanut butter with puppies all around, Aww. like a boss. That's so sad. That sounds like a weird afternoon. Lilies! Lilies! Dominion Way says, I'd cure gingers. That's not very nice. No! That's not that. nice. Embrace diversity and difference. Unless they're too different. By the way, uh, Isla Fisher, isn't she a ginger? Oh, yeah, she's a natural ah, ginger. You, don't you refer to her as Isla Fisher? Is the Fisher? I mean, it was. Didn't you say? I mean, Isla I think Fisher it was or, like a day or something. It was a we day talk. It was, it was Isla Fisher. It was, was not. It with, we all thought. Wasn't with me and you, and Phil, during a table people. talk for which you include the sanitation and also while you're there, subscribe to youtubecom slash nerds. That was Isla a Fisher. very natural plug. You know who I really love? Nicolay Kidman, as mm -hmm. a redhead. Yeah, Nicolay I love Kidman Nicolay Kidman. Kidman. I really like uh, uh, Natalie uh, Poe Ruthman. Who's oh that? yeah. She's Nitalie Poe Ruthman. Yeah. She's a yeah. 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 She's, uh, she's a actress. She was yeah. in Black she's Swan. Great. She's very she talented. Was great. Who was she in great. Black Swan? She was. Really uh, she's the main great. character. She was the the Swan. Yeah. I guess. Yeah. She was a. Uh, she's not uh, not the Myla Kunis girl, but she was uh, the yeah. other girl. Are you? We're making fun of you because you mispronounced Isla Fisher's oh, name, and we're ostracizing you. I mean, it really wasn't that big of a deal, is it? Tell I, Isla. I mean, I'm sorry. Okay, can I speak to her then? Can we? Can we have a moment? I'm we sorry. Moment? Okay, yeah. Isla Fisher. I'm sorry. Now that I know that your name is not Isla, because I thought, how weird is it that someone's name works the same way a, the word island does? I'm sorry. Forgive me. Yes, we can make out. Yes, I'll take you to my parents' house. Yes, you'll meet my dogs. My wife is... Totally cool with it. Are you sure about that? Beautiful. That runs for mayor! What? Stupid I cat. Know. A cat named Morris is running for uh, the mayor of Celapa in eastern Mexico. And uh, mainly because, you know, they didn't want to, they didn't think they had a good enough candidate. And it might be a well, They didn't statement. have any other candidates. Or a good either. candidate. Ah! Boom! Hey! We're uh, paid! You know what I mean? Beautiful. Wait, is he a Democrat? Oh! oh!
He's a Republican. <laughs> That's really beautiful. For real? And we asked you guys, should people be allowed to vote for an animal if they don't approve of other candidates? Yeah, of course. You know what's cool? The cat has no idea it's running for mayor. Yeah. Well, Steve has a thought. I do have a thought. Re Repo Republican, Re Republic cat party. Party. Potty. Oh, potty. Republican Diane, party. Like Diane, we're gonna need Republic a new party. head of the the campaign. We're gonna need a new campaign head because he's been doing this the hold entire time. Hold on. Okay, hold on. Time. Yeah, it's uh uh. We won't get into your frisky. That's our slogan. Our campaign slogan. Um, kibbles and bits, more like kibbles and. Steve, Vote for this guy. Random Beastie says, as long as he's old enough in cat years, I don't want no damn kitten running my town. I'd like a full-grown adult gato making decisions. That's oh, very good. That's a great comment. Uh, Dad Goodman says, uh, Can you please read all comments in the voice? In the that, voice? That you did. Sure. Dad Goodman says, the cat mayor will end all corruption with his cuteness. Do another one. Do okay. another one. Nathaniel Snow says, remember that time everyone joked and voted for Arnold Schwarzenegger? Oh wait, my bad. That happened too. Do another. Well, says first they run the internet, now they are running for office. Cats really are trying to rule the world. Okay, no? Claro que sí. Muy caliente. Cervezas para tú, para mí. I want subtitles and just be like, for you, for me, <laughs> <laughs> but, what, and? Yeah, exactly. I feel like you should do everything. Yeah, why not? Thank you for clucking and comment, comment there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh -huh. All right, Thank so we we'll do the, is that, do you have an out there? Are we good? <laughs> that, was, that was the out. Hey guys, thanks for joining us for Comic Commentary. This was a lot of fun. So uh, in honor of how much fun we've had doing this, we're gonna have uh, Steve do the remainder of the outro in his amazing oh. um, Hispanic, cultural, accurate accent. Thank you very much for watching Comic Commentary. I'm Esteban Zaragoza. This is Lee Newton. And that's Elian Moria. And then we also have other things coming up this weekend. Like, like other things, right? Like bloopers? Do you guys have bloopers? Bloopers, we have bloopers. You have bloopers? There's also a through there there that's coming up this weekend. Claro que sí, it's going to be very entertaining. Also, on Zorro that Nerd, Joe Barreda and I saw World War Z. That's probably up already, though. You can go to the <laughs> Nerd channel and see it. So we did Movie Club, and we watched the movie Super Troopers. You're starting to look painful now. Yeah, are you okay? Uh, uh, it's because I, I really have to poop. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much for joining us, guys, and, and we hope that you enjoy the show. Also, he's a cat. You get it? Because that's in reference yeah, to the, it's, the it's one we did back. where you can watch the clip yeah. right here if you click it. If you click the clip. Me, listen, mija, you can come home with me and I will make you burritos, I'll make you chilequiles, and I will make you uh, cerveza Help. con uh, limon, and I will also put Help. a little bit of the menudo Help. in the pie. Have you ever Help. had menudo? It's oh, like it's a breakfast. A strong you know what it is? Help. It's a breakfast. Oh, oh man. It's He's also, not it joking around, it man. It also has three pasta okay. it, and also, right. oh, oh, I will oh, treat you like right. a baby. No. I'll take you home. Wow. It's, it blows de my mind. Colores, de colores, de colores, los campos de la primavera. I am blown away. De How strong is Grippus? De colores, de colores, de campos de la primavera. Feliz Navidad. It's Feliz like... Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Buen año y felicidad. How about I wish you a Merry Christmas? How about I wish you a Merry Christmas? How about I wish you a Merry Christmas? From the bottom of my heart.